Hi, I'm Marco Rubio. Just two years ago, I was an underdog candidate for the United States Senate. Few of any here in Washington believed that I had a chance to win. Many actively worked against us. At a time when I believed that the Republican Party should offer a clear alternative to the Democrats and President Obama, not join them. Well, two years later, a lot has happened. Not just in Florida, but across the country, candidates were elected on a very clear mandate and platform to come to Washington, D.C., to stand up to the direction that President Obama and the Democrats are taking our country and to offer in its place a clear alternative. But as recent events and the debate in Washington about the debt limit remind us, we haven't come far enough. The United States Senate is still in hands of Democratic leaders who don't fully believe in the American free enterprise system and don't take seriously the enormous risk that our national debt places on our country and its future. And of course, the White House is still occupied by someone whose policies have failed the American people, where unemployment is higher than it was when he took office, and there's no end in sight. That's why we've started Reclaim America PAC, in the hopes of supporting candidates all across this country that will come to Washington and join us in standing up to these policies that have failed us and in its place offering clear alternatives. And that's why we're asking for your support. We're asking you to sign on to our Facebook page and to our Twitter feed, to follow the work we're doing and to contribute so that all across America we can go out and help and assist like-minded candidates who want to come here and serve in the House and the Senate or maybe even in the White House to make a difference for America's future. Thank you for all the support and encouragement you've given me in the past and I look forward to working with you to reclaim America, to reclaim a better future for our children, our grandchildren, and the generations yet to come. May God bless all of you and may God bless the United States of America.